Meine Nerven. <lacht> okay, das sind nur kleinere Episoden. Kurz vor dem, oder direkt beim Ausbruch, kurz danach, was auch immer. Damit kann ich leben. Shell, Tag 236. Hey Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this? What do you think that does to a kid? I don't know. I know it's changed me, well, all of us, but at this age, for her, I don't know. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh, no, I don't think so. You just make sure those flashlights are all working. We don't want anyone getting stuck in the dark. Yeah, that would suck. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Eesh, these knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. Huh, still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope, still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. so knatschig. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. Das ist aber eine recht große Gruppe noch, ne? Die sich ja scheinbar sehr gut. Kann ich mit dir reden? Uh, you guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Ähm, die sich ja scheinbar recht gut arrangieren kann mit allem. How's Joyce today? She seems good. Clive's watching over her, as usual. Oof. Talk about survivors. Those guys have been through a lot. Okay, wie komme ich nach hinten hier durch? Was mal angucken? Hey Becca, think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh yeah, then we can spend all our money at nowhere. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. Uh. Ah, da schauen wir noch die Finger davon. I wouldn't give her a cup of coffee in the morning. Wo ist er denn? Da hinten? I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. Ooh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. 
Ja. Oh. Oh, you scared me. He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. He's not an animal, Roman. Well, it's not human either. Not anymore. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Beeil dich mal. Oh Gott. Oh ist ein Hund? Oh. Okay. Wer hat sie denn denn erwischt? Noch was? Eine unsichtbare Wand. Gehen wir wieder rein. Das war ja voll hilfreich gerade. <lacht> oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again! Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's. It's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and and now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell, Becca, something's going on outside. What is it? I don't know, something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop them. It's so care we be Jesus. Largum. My God. Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Who is he? I got no idea. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. Second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. Vernon was out for the boat the whole time. And the second they left that boat unattended, we just stole it. 
That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. You're right. It's got to be one or the other. We are letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. Oh, I'm telling you, can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? We can't take the risk. We kill him. There's got to be another way. Tell me, what if he comes back? With weapons, or, or a gang? Is it worth losing any one of us? Jesus, there really is no other choice, is there? We can't keep him here, and we can't let him go. Let's mop them. If there's even it's a okay chance of him coming back, or telling folks that might try to hurt us, we can't oh, risk it. I won't ask you to watch, but if we do this, we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. Also die gehört zu Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time. Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Okay, da geht's nicht weiter. Das ist ja furchtbar deprimierend alles. Ja, ich weiß, es ist eine Zombie-Apokalypse. Es muss deprimierend sein. Naja, muss es nicht, aber es ist es einfach. Hallo? Willst du das nicht angucken? How come no one's watering these? Warum sind sie trotzdem so grün? Hey. Shell. It's Stephanie. What? Roman's got her locked up like some kind of animal. They said she was trying to escape. They actually used that word. Escape. Boyd, calm down. I knew something like this was going to happen, Shell. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. And now look where we are. I'm gonna go talk to Roman. No, no, just take Becca and get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things are good here. We just have to stick together and follow the rules. Just 
Don't do anything stupid. Äh, es war die Junge, ne? Also die, wo ihr, also die, wo Becker hey, das, das Gitarrenspiel gebracht hat. Warum hast du das gemacht? Wir sind hier. Es gibt keinen Grund, um zu gehen. Ich bin sicher, sie hatte ihre Gründe. Ich gehe zu Roman sprechen. Wir werden es herausfinden. Ich werde es herausfinden. Das ist wirklich notwendig. Roman? Gut, du bist hier. Ich habe gehört über Stephanie. Ich bin sorry. Was wirst du machen? Du weißt, was wir machen. Was hat passiert? Wir haben sie versucht, sie zu verabschieden. Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Ich mach das nicht. No. The last time we did this, we agreed that next time it'd fall to someone else. I'm asking you to do it. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. When she tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo, she knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. <sighs> Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Uh, let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. Ganz ehrlich? Fine. Go ahead. No! Roman said he wants you to do it. I'll do it when it's my turn. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Shell. Time. Das 
ist wirklich jetzt gerade nicht leicht. <lacht> Ich meine, es war schon echt scheiße. Ich meine, wenn Stefanie einfach so abgehauen wäre, sie vielleicht nur ein bisschen was mitgenommen hätte, wäre es vielleicht nicht ganz so schlimm gewesen. Andererseits ist jetzt natürlich die Frage, wenn wir nicht abhauen, wann sind wir als nächstes dran? Ähm, die Gruppe zerfällt eh schon. Ähm... Andererseits, wenn wir jetzt halt einfach fliehen mit dem Camper, wir hinterlassen ein Riesenloch erstmal in der Schutzmauer. Ähm okay. Ähm ich möchte hier gerne anmerken, dass das eigentlich äh, total gegen meinen ethischen Vorstellungen geht. Ich könnte niemanden erschießen, aber das ist ein Spiel und wir wollen ein bisschen... Spaß haben? Nein, aber also ich würde es in, in Realität nicht tun. Ähm Außer natürlich, man würde drohen, mich zu erschießen. Wobei das halt immer die Sache ist, wäre das jetzt meine beste Freundin, ich könnte sie nicht erschießen. Ist einfach so. Ich würde sie vermutlich schnappen und abhauen. Da habe ich jetzt aber hier nicht die Möglichkeit. Aber das hätte ich vermutlich dann mit meiner besten Freundin im Geheimen schon vorher ausgeknobelt. Ähm, ob es nicht vielleicht besser wäre zu gehen. In der Situation, entweder wir fahren ab. Riskieren aber halt auch einfach, alle zurückzulassen, die ja eigentlich nichts dafür können. Und im Prinzip, ja, wir sind ein bisschen mit Schuld. Wir haben das mit entschieden. Ähm... Ach komm. I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. Sorry. Me too. Find ich war echt gemein vom Roman, weil er genau weiß, dass das unsere Freundin ist. Finde ich echt auch ein bisschen asozial von ihm. Verlorenes Paradies. Wir haben noch drei. 